Good morning, my name is Sauraba and you are watching today's video of Perfect Mobile Solution Friends. It is about nothing FRP of nothing phone. In this video, I will tell you how to remove I have an online customer. The problem with their nothing phone to away device is that the device is FRP lock. Gmail ID is locked. If your Google account is locked, how to remove FRP of such nothing phone to A or how to remove FRP of any mobile of nothing I will tell you in this video. At the same time friends, how to flash any device of nothing, be it any model, how to do full flash, how to do software. In this video, I am going to tell you step by step. So please watch the video from here, don't escape. First of all friends, I will open the device manager from here by right clicking on the window device manager so that I can check whether the customer's device is connecting to the PC or not. Okay, when the device is connected, then the port will show in the device manager. Okay, how to connect the device? Listen carefully, two ways, off happens. What do you have to do? Switch off the mobile phone and connect the direct cable. There is no button to press. Okay, then your device will be connected to the PC. The port will show here. Well, I have told the customer to connect the device directly to the PC by switching off the mobile phone or if you switch off the mobile and press both the volume up and down buttons to install the cable, your device will still be connected to the PC. Well, you can try both ways, okay? Now, as soon as the customers connect the device to the PC, you will see every device will show the port in the manager. Now see this friends, the customer connected the device to the PC. You can see MediaTek port show and I'll show you. See the port has come and gone. Okay, means the device is connecting to the PC. Now I've opened the browser here. First of all, I have given the link of the flash file to the customer. And here you can see that the customer has downloaded the flash file of the device, which is the firmware. This is the location. If this is a G file, what should I do with it? First, I will strike. Okay, there is a G file. There are different flash files of different models. Then I had given the flash file to the customer. So the customer had downloaded and kept it. Now I'm striking the file. Now friends, let's talk about how to install drivers on Google you will write Oppo MT driver. This is the first page you are seeing, Oppo new MT driver. You simply have to click on this. So GSM is the website of the mafia. You will click on it, it will open, and I will tell you which version you have to download from here. A little bit, you will come down, then see this 3.2.1, you will click on this. A new page will open here by clicking on arrow from the site and see this is Google Drive. You will click on download from here. This is the first drive. You have to install the second. You have to write the driver of SPMT on Google. You will enter by writing MediaTek SP driver shown at the top. You have to click on it. Then a new pop-up will open here. Click here to download. Primary download will click on it. These two drivers you have to download. Okay. These two are the most important drivers and both of them were downloaded. First of all, the driver of Oppo MT is G file. Then I will install it by clicking on it. The installation processor is very simple. Just watch the video carefully, okay? This is 3.2.1, I will double click on it. It will ask for password, yes, you have to do it. After that, it will open and install it. It is a very simple processor, next, next, just install it. Okay, the driver is installing, let me show you one second. This is the backside, you can see right now the second driver is the driver of MediaTek SPMT. You have to install this, okay? Then the first one will be installed first. There will be a little processor here. Here you do not have to restart the PC by clicking no, you will finish. Well, if you do not want to restart, then see here driver installation processor takes some time. Here we wait until it is installed when it will be installed. So now see that it has been installed. Now you will install it by double clicking on the MediaTek SK driver. It is a simple processor, just have to do next, next. Pay attention to one thing here. See the message has come, right? If you have connected your device to a PC, disconnect the USB cable and install this driver. See it installed. You have to restart the PC here or not. Even if you restart it, it will work, but we'll restart it. Okay, now I come to your flash file, double click on this flash file and look here. These files are okay, which is below the nothing flash tool. Open this tool by double clicking on it. That's what will flash this device. This is a flash tool. You will come to the partition, suck partition to flash by checking the FRP here. And after that you will do. Yes, you will do okay. Now you have to connect the device to the PC. Then I have told you the method. There are two simple ways to turn off your phone. Install the cable by pressing both the volume up and down buttons. Then your device will still be connected to the PC or try this first. 
If that doesn't work, turn your phone back on and off. Then connect the direct cable, switch off the mobile and connect the direct cable. Okay? I have told the customer to connect the device to the PC. Uh, I'll try it first. Switch off the mobile and install the direct cable. Okay? And we will see here, the port will show this. See, it is connected. The device has been connected to the PC and you can see it here. It is seen connected in the tool and I will show you here. The port is also showing in the device manager and I clicked on start and see this flashing has started. Okay, you have to wait until the flashing is complete. Your device should not be disconnected from your PC. If these cases are disconnected, there will be problems. The device can be your hang on logo. Okay, so if you have any phone of nothing, if your device has FRP lock or your device has hang on logo, be any model. So you have to contact me for that. My contact details are available in the description box. Note that if it is a paid tool, then you will have to pay whatever charges there are. I will provide you the flash file that will be in accordance with whatever models you have. First, you need to download the flash file. After that, I will connect the entire processor to your PC, okay? Whatever the processor, step by step, I told you which drivers to install, how to install, all those things I told you. If you have installed the drivers in your laptop properly, your device will connect to the PC and the flash processor will start. So now you can see the flash processor, which is 17%. It takes a bit of time, okay? Then you have to wait until it is completely completed. When this processor is complete, then the message of task complete green color will come and your device will be automatically turned on and the port that is not will be automatically disconnected. So now we wait until it is a 100% complete. Now friends seen here, the flashing which is 19 has reached 7% and just now this flashing is going to be completed. This 19 has happened as soon as it will be 100%, the message of task complete will come and the device will be your automatic on and the port will be disconnected. Look, the message of task complete came and if you pay attention in the device manager, then there the port is automatically disconnected. This means that your device is now on, all right? So this is the complete full processor. When the task comes complete, the flashing of this device has been completely completed. Now friends, you have to do the complete setup. You have to wait until the device is completely on first, then you will do the complete setup. You will see that the FRP lock on your device has been completely removed. So friends, in this video, I told you how to flash any phone of nothing do software, then if you also have any device of nothing, your device has hang on logo or your device has FRP lock, then for this, you definitely contact me. My contact details are available in the description box. Device turned on, look down A142. When this model was shown here on the laptop, this means that your device is completely on. I hope you enjoy the video. Information will be good. If you like the video, please share it as much as possible. Like, definitely support the channel to get continuous notification of such wonderful, interesting videos. Subscribe. Thanks for watching this video.